Hi guys, I'm Hayden from Watt & Care Electrical, of course from Trusted Electrician. A few days ago, a friend of mine got in touch and he said the LED light bulbs in his house keep failing and he wanted to know why that was happening because in the box that they come in, it said they have a lifespan of about 15,000 hours. Now the light bulbs he was using were something similar to this, nothing fancy, it's just a normal LED light bulb uh, with a bayonet cap uh, fitting. This would be something that you would stick into a ceiling light. If I flip the camera around for you now and I'll show you the components on the inside of that. So the first thing we're going to look at is this little unit here and this has little orangey yellowy modules on and those are the LEDs themselves. LED, LED stands for light emitting diode and it's those modules that actually give off the light and they do have a really long lifespan of about 15,000 plus hours. Generally speaking, they operate on either 12 or 24 volt DC and the home, uh, your electric in your home is at 230 volts AC. If we put 230 volts through these LEDs, it's just going to blow the LEDs and then they won't work. So we need another component which looks similar to this. This is called an LED driver or an LED transformer um, and it's just got a few different components on there. Um, and what this does is it transforms the voltage from 230 volt AC down to the 12 or 24 volt DC that the LEDs need. On cheaper light bulbs or light fittings, it's this component that fails. And then when one of the units on there fails, obviously your light bulb won't work or the LEDs themselves won't light up. For light fittings or light bulbs like this, they're all integrated like you can't take this apart to get to the driver unless you break it open which is what i've done to get those out so if if they fail you need to replace the whole unit so when it comes to light bulbs it's always better if you spend a few extra pounds per light bulb to get a much better quality one and your led drivers should then last a lot longer